Welcome back, nerds. Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to explain School of Athens. In this event, you join two other players in a team to debate masters and professors. You'll have to either form a team or apply to someone else's. You will start off with a debate score dependent on your total knight power. You can and should increase your knight power with gold. I recommend that you at least increase your score so that you are able to defeat Professor Zeno on the third floor. If you are going for the win, you'll want to increase your score much higher than that. Don't forget to open event scrolls throughout the event to boost your score. There are three floors and you want to reach the third floor to debate other players to earn certificates. If you are defeated by another player on the third floor, you will be sent back down to the second. You have to defeat 15 masters or professors to go up to the next floor. The layout of the floors gives you a 50% chance to land on a professor or master, so it'll require about 30 stamina to go up each, each floor, give or take a couple stamina. You can always use a Eureka to ascend and skip the requirement too. Click the explore button to select a random character to debate. Then click the debate button and the person will be reduced by your knight score. If you need assistance defeating a scholar, click the mark button and your team will also debate the scholar. Pro tip, if you find yourself waiting on your team to log in and debate your mark, but you don't want to avoid the scholar you just landed on, and you also need help with that same scholar, you can click the top left hand corner arrow to go back to the rest of the KC game. That way, you can come back later once your team has hopped on and mark the scholar that will be still sitting there waiting for you. I also suggest you try to go up with your team at the same time to clear out the floor fast and together. Just send them a message to coordinate. You'll be able to mark and debate at the same time when you're up there and have a huge advantage. I recommend you save up stamina before you go to the third floor also and maximize your two minute safety timer on the third floor before it expires and other players can attack you. I hope this helps you guys. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one.